Hey everybody, in today's video I'm going to show you how you can adjust the complications on your Cento vertical watch face. Now if you've watched my videos in the past, I've shown you how you can change watch faces. The first thing you want to do is change your watch face, figure out what watch face you want to use. Second thing you're going to want to do is go in and adjust the complication. So what is a complication? It's basically the data fields that are showing on the watch face. I've got sunrise and sunset information up here. I've got a second uh, display that's showing here. And then at the bottom, I've got my altitude. We want to change that. How would we do it? There's a few different ways you can do it. I'm going to be doing it through the basic settings on the watch using the button here. This is a touchscreen watch. I'm going to be using buttons just because it makes it a little bit clearer for you so I don't have fingerprints all over the screen. I'm going to start by pressing and holding the middle button on the right hand side. That will take me to my settings menu. And then I'm going to use the down button, which is the bottom right button. And we're going to go to customize. When I'm on customize, again, I'm going to press the middle button on the right to choose the customize options. And then we're going to go down to complications. I'll press the middle button to choose complications. It's going to show me my current watch face. So again, you want your watch face that you're wanting to edit because that's going to be what's showing in the editor. And then you're going to see each of the complications kind of highlighted here. You'll see this little circle in the top left, circle in the top right, and then a box down here in the bottom that kind of tells me my complications. I can use the up or down button to jump to a different complication. So if I just want to change the bottom one, I would go to that one. If I want to go to any of the other ones, I can use the up or down button. On the given complication that I want to change, all I'm going to do is press the GPS button and it will show me all of the other things I can change it to. So I'm just going to go through here and show you. You can pretty much choose anything you want. So let's pick something just for kick's sake, just to change it. Remember before it was a second display. Let's just choose moon phase. Now, instead of seconds, I'm showing moon phase. I'm going to press the down button, go to the next complication, and do the exact same thing. I'm going to click on that complication, and I'm going to go through and figure out what is it that I want to change it to. You'll notice they kind of categorize it, like here's my outdoor section. There's my activity and recovery section, so on and so forth. So I'm going to just change this one to that second display. You also don't have to have a complication on. You can turn any of them off that you want to. I'll do that with this bottom one. I'm going to go to the bottom complication. Again, I'm going to press the middle button to choose it. If you go to the very top, you'll see an option for empty. And I can press that, and that complication is now going to be off. If I press the down button, you'll get to a screen that says done. I could use the up button to go back to any of the previous complications we looked at. I'm simply going to press the middle button to say I'm done. It takes me out of that editor. I can press and hold the middle button to go back. And now we've successfully adjusted the complications on our watch face. Really simple stuff. Don't forget, this is per watch face. So if you wanted to go change a different watch face, you could just change the watch face and then go into the complications and adjust it for that watch face. Hope the video helped.